Welcome to Game Over, Olympic edition coming to you straight from Tokyo. Plenty of Indian action today started pretty badly with Vikas Krishan Yadav. Vikas Krishan Yadav feigning injury and I think that was wrong. He should not have played if he was injured, that's what he did. He had a tendon problem in Italy. I have seen the x-ray reports, I have seen the other reports. If you are injured, you are not supposed to play in an Olympic competition. That's what Vikas Krishan Yadav did. I do not think this was a good gesture from the senior boxer. He was nursing that injury from Italy. He came over to Japan, he got injections done, he went and played. That was a pretty wrong gesture from Vikas Krishan Yadav. In shooting, disappointment with Divyansh and uh, Deepak Kumar losing out and of course Manu and Yashashwini. But Manu unfortunate because her gun malfunctioned as a result of which she wasn't able to make the final heroic. Courageous effort from Manu. I keep saying in shooting we will win a medal. Do not be disappointed. Upset in, in uh, uh, one has to say. Uh, I, was a, I was a little taken aback uh, by Divyansh Panwar. Very upset. Uh, why would he shoot like that? But such things happen in an Olympic Games. Australia totally dominated India in hockey. India did not start too badly, but Australia converted all their chances. And that's what the difference is between a top side and a good side. Australia is a genuinely top side and it was once again evident in Tokyo. India has to get better because from quarterfinal onwards, we will not have a chance to make a mistake. The high point of the day was of course Manika Batra and uh, uh, Mary Com. MC Mary Com was superb against her younger opponent winning uh, that bout, making it to the round of 16. Magnificent Mary well and truly on a roll and said that the only, only medal missing is the Olympic gold medal. That is what she's after. PB Sindhu, simple round, but started well, finishing off in 28 minutes. We want PB Sindhu to roll on. Badminton campaign, except uh, Sai Pranit, has gotten off to a very, very decent start. And my high point, as I said, is Manika Batra. Manika was, was stellar. Manika was really stellar because after being 2-0 down against the Ukrainian opponent, came back and won that contest 4-3. Terrific from Manika Batra. So that's what it is. Uh, huge day tomorrow for the, for the double spare of Satvik and Chirag taking on the world number one. In Skeet, keep a watch on Angad Bajwa. Plenty of action coming your way and I will be back with more editions of uh, Game Over. Keep watching.